An entertaining knock down the order by Norman Vanua gave PNG fans some late hope. He and Kipling Doriga added 53 of just 29 balls, but having been 35 for 5 at that point in chase of a target of 166, PNG had left it too much too late. Kabua Morea, PNG's top bowler, got four wickets for 31 runs in four overs. Chet Sopa took three wickets for 24 runs in four overs, and Simon Atai grabbed one wicket. PNG were all out for 148 in 19.3 overs, with Norman Vanua top scoring with 47 of 37 balls, including two sixes and four twos. Sese Bao 24, Kiprin Doriga 18, Asad Vala 18, and Chad Sopa 16. Scotland's 17-run win was their seventh tiniest victory in T20 internationals in terms of runs and their second tiniest victory over PNG in T20 internationals. With last night's loss their second in the tournament, PNG will find it difficult to make it past the first round. PNG's 148 was their ninth highest total in T20 internationals, their second highest total against Scotland in T20 internationals and their best total in the T20 World Cup. They had previously scored 129 against Oman at the same site earlier in the tournament. Kabwa Morea's 4 for 31 is the greatest bowling figure by a PNG bowler against Scotland in T20 internationals and the best bowling statistics by a PNG bowler in the T20 World Cup. In their last Group B match this Thursday, PNG will play Bangladesh, who beat Oman by 26 runs last night. Only the top two in the group will advance to the next stage of the ICC. Terry Longwood, TV One Sports.